Today I'm going to show you how to enable hardware acceleration for video playback and other things like OBS. So to present to you that this is actually currently not working correctly, I go here to the settings, output, advanced, and here we have only x264, which is a software encoder. So I close OBS at this point here. And now let's go into my root user and we go to Etsy Next OS. Yeah, I can show you real quick. So I have created this file called hardwareacceleration.nix that will show you what it looks like. So to be able to have it run as a normal configuration file, which I import later, I will show you how that works. I just created this header here. And then here is what makes this file work. So to see exactly what happens with those, I recommend reading up about that on the NixOS files, uh, NixOS wiki. It will show you exactly what to do. But you can basically grab and go this, with this file. And I will also upload it to my GitHub so you can just use it from there. And here we go out of there. And then I go into my configuration.nix file. And here in the import section, we just go here and type hardware acceleration.nix. We save this and say nix OS rebuild switch. Once this is done rebuilding, we open OBS again and you can see that the functionality for FFmpeg hardware encoding will work. And if you have something like an NVIDIA card, it should technically then also enable the NVENG encoder. So I close this and I open OBS Studio. Yes, I have to launch it anyway because I'm already recording. And now we can go into the settings. Output. We still will not have an option here, but this is because of my graphics card, because I just have an Intel integrated one. That's OK. But I can go here, and it will switch to FFmpeg via API. You can also manually select it, but there, that should enable your encoder. You can set up the settings, and that's about it. I really hope you enjoyed that video, and it helped you further, and I'll see you next time.